All right, we're sitting here at the house with uh, <laughs> Dallas Stars netminder, Kari Lettinen. Kari, thanks for sitting down with me and uh, signing the Panini cards. Yeah, no problem. Uh, just got a couple questions for you today. Um, first of all, what do you think about these uh, Panini cards that you're signing? These are pretty cool. New kind, some sort of leather. I've never seen anything like this before, but uh, always you guys come up with something new. Oh, great. Well, I'm glad you like them. Uh, so, you were telling me before I started this interview that uh, you used to collect cards out in Finland. Uh, tell me a little bit about that and who you collected. Uh, just just hockey cards in, in general. Some like uh, some from Finland, like Finnish cards, and uh, they're, you know, Finnish players from Finnish league, and, uh, and some NHL cards. And uh, I guess it was somewhere... Somewhere mid nineties, I was you know twelve or my teenage years, and uh, sorry about that. <laughs> <It's> all right. <laughs> my teenage it's years, right. and uh, oh, it was it was fun. Did it with my father and friends, and you know I don't know what really was my favorite. Probably all the goalie cards was just nice. I was excited about those, of course, <laughs> and uh, you know. Might have traded Kretzky card for Felix Putman or something like that. Just, well, that's a uh, crazy trade, but <laughs> I know, <laughs> it shows but your allegiance. Yeah, I made that trade, but uh, you know. Well, great. Well, uh, having a card right now, uh, Panini card, what does it mean to you having your own trading card and signing them and knowing that your fans, sort of like you when you were younger, are collecting these? What does that mean to you? Uh, it's pretty cool. You know, it's something... Uh, you know, while I was buying hockey cards, I I didn't even thought about that. Uh, you know, this this day might might happen one day, and uh, you know, it, it's it's quite nice when you think about it. How I remember how excited I got when I got some goalies cards, and you know, I'm sure there is, uh, or I hope there is some 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 kids that uh, that get kick out of this and. And uh, maybe have their own cards in the future. <laughs> so, uh, is there times now that uh, you know you're you're on the ice, you're getting ready for a game, or in between intermission, you're thinking about trading cards? <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, you know, there's there's usually if you're thinking too much something else than stopping the pucks, then uh, you know you're in trouble on the <laughs> ice. There's uh, it's not too much extra time, but. Uh, so you're not thinking, oh, I got those penny cards I need to sign when I get home today. <laughs> oh, I should. Yeah, it just took a little too long to get this signed. But you guys were pushing me. And, you know, no, we're, uh, we're delighted to have you signed today. <laughs> uh, so talk about your autograph a little bit and, and take us through how you developed uh, this one. Well, I don't know. Is there, um, it's just kind of... Uh, been getting shorter and shorter over time, and uh, I try. I start with the K, and then there's all kinds of little weird things. There may be a little L for my last name, and it used to be all all the letters from my name, really, and you could see them. But uh, uh, -huh. uh I don't know. Then it just kind of got shorter and shorter when I, you know, started playing pro and. You know, we were asked to sign a lot of things, and, you know, I don't know if it's going to be just number 32 at some point in my career. <laughs> hopefully I well, hopefully I not play uh, that long. And <laughs> well, as a, as a company, we hope it doesn't turn to that, but it's a, it's a nice signature, it's nice and full, and it's, uh, it's very different, so, so we like it. Uh, I got one last question for you, and that is, uh, once you retire from the NHL, mm -hmm. um, what would you hope the back of your card would say once you're done with your NHL career? Uh, well, the biggest thing would be nice to have is uh, Stanley Cup, winning the Stanley Cup and, you know, being one of the top goalies in the league, you know, that uh, those are two things I'm sure that, that every goalie wants to was to get to that point and uh, hopefully hopefully I'm gonna get there at uh, in the near future well hopefully uh, some kid in the future will uh, 
trade a Sidney Crosby for a Kari Latinan Kari. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm sure I would have done it when I was a kid. But <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks so much, Kari, and uh, uh, keep signing those panini cards. Yeah, thank you. <laughs>